So, uh, animal care yes, specialist. We're talk about, that, yes. We're tell gonna, us what we're talking about today. We're going to talk about some arthritis today. Okay. So, just the colder weather's coming in. So, many of our pets are going to experience a lot more arthritic pain. And so, they're going to be limping and maybe doing things around the house. Um, number one thing I want to stress is that you don't want to really self-medicate at home. A lot of the over-the-counter formulations that work for us for pain right. are very deadly and dangerous to dogs and Isn't cats. Is that right? Yes. Stuff that we can ingest will actually kill your four-legged friend. Correct. Huh. Yes. Why uh, is that? The dosage? The dosage and the, the formulation and the drug. Hmm. And so they're very toxic mostly to the kidneys. And so, um, you know, Tylenol to a cat will kill it. Motrin to a cat will will definitely kill them okay. as well. Uh, dogs cannot take Excedrin and uh, Ibuprofen. They're very, very harmful to the kidneys. If you're gonna use anything over the counter, I would use only plain aspirin, and it's not very good long-term. It causes a lot of gastric ulcers, pain in the abdomen, things like that. Well, I would never think about giving Barney or Mr. Tudor, right. my medication. We want to see you to get that kind of stuff. Correct, right? yes. Okay. Because we have a lot more sophisticated medications now for dogs for pain, mm -hmm. as well as cats for pain, that are going to treat their symptoms and make them feel much better than they would if we give them over-the-counter formulations that could c create problems in their internal system. Okay. So we use a lot more, uh, they're, they're a lot better. They may be a little bit more expensive, but they're a lot better for the pets. Okay. Um, it looks like we're going to trend colder before Christmas. Yes. Um, we're going to start to see those salt trucks get out there and put yes. some salt on the roads. I'm worried about Barney's pads on his feet because yes. he loves to run and they can be aggravated with uh, some of those chemicals that are going to be out on the road. Yes. What should yes. we do with that? So uh, there's definitely, you want to rinse their paws if they've been out walking when on the streets. In? Yeah. Okay. Rinse them off, wash them really well, get them nice and dry. Um, there are a lot of pet safe products, so if you're going to salt your own yards or your own sidewalks, make sure that you're using the pet safe products because okay. it will help quite a bit. Great. Brooke West, Dr. Brooke West, thanks Sounds so good. much. Nice Hope to you see have you. a Merry Christmas. You too. Good to see you too. Good to see you.